In this video, we will show you how to import MMD files into Unity and add motion and facial capture. You will need the following tools. First, MMD4 Mechanism, which helps import MMD files into Unity. Then the Blender plugin MMD underscore tools, which allows us to work with MMD texture files. Additionally, you will need the Dollars Mocap plugin to integrate Dollars Mocap products in Unity. Lastly, we will use Blend Shape Builder, which simplifies facial capture setup. For this demonstration, we will use the MMD model of Velen. You can find the download links for these plugins and files in the video description. First, create a new Unity project, unzip MMD4 mechanism, and import the MMD4 mechanism.unity package into the project. It is recommended to restart the project after importing. Next, open Blender, go to the Preferences tab, and select MMD underscore tools in the add-on section. Install and activate it. Back in Unity, create a directory named Velen to store Velen-related files. Unzip the MMD file package and drag the PMX file into the Velen directory. Select the file, agree to the terms, and then process. Once processing is complete, select the generated FBX file and set its rig type to humanoid. Open the newly created materials directory in the Velen folder. You will see the materials used by the model, but the textures are not set. To identify the textures for each material, we will use Blender with MMD underscore tools. Import the PMX file into Blender. Select Velen's Mesh, and in the Material Properties, you can see the materials used by the mesh. The number of materials matches those in the Unity Materials directory. If you understand some Japanese, you will find they correspond one-to-one. -one. Let's adjust the window layout for convenience, and drag the textures from the MMD file into the materials directory in Unity. In Blender, select the first material, open the surface tab, and then open the base text to see it uses the texture .tga. In Unity, select the first material and set its main text to .tga. Repeat the same steps for the other materials, checking their textures in Blender and setting them in Unity. With the material set up, drag the FBX file into the scene. Let's adjust the position and scene lighting. In the MMD4 Mechanism model component, open the Physics tab and select Bullet Physics in the Physics engine. Run the project and move the model to see that the physics simulation is active. 
Next, let's set up Dollars Mocap plugin. Import the Dollars Mocap plugin. Drag the Dollars M Mocap prefab from the plugins folder into the scene. Add a MOCAP SRC component to Velen. Then, drag the dollars MOCAP object in the scene into the SRC variable. Adjust the skeleton so that Velen's model is in a T-pose. To ensure motion capture executes before the physics simulation, open the project settings. In the script execution order, add dollars.mocapsrc and move it before bullet physics. Open the dollars mocap program, here, we are using dollars mono which uses web camera or video file as input. In the settings dialog of dollars mono, check stream to unity. Back in Unity, run the project, and you can perform real-time motion capture with Velen. Finally, let's add facial capture for Velen. Unzip Blend Shape Builder and copy the Blend Shape Builder and Vertex Tweaker directories from the Assets folder into the project. After Unity finishes compiling, you will see new items in the window menu. Open Velen's Mesh. You will find that the mesh does not have blend shapes for facial capture but we can still use existing blend shapes for facial capture. For example, these blend shapes are for closing eyes, smiling, and opening the mouth. First, add a face cap controller. Set the SRC variable to the $MO cap object in the scene. Next, there are two arrays. One specifies the meshes with blend shapes, and the other maps facial capture parameters to blend shapes. Since only one mesh has facial blend shapes, set both arrays length to 1. Drag the face mesh of Velen into the first array. In the project view, right-click and create a new dollars face capture mappings file. Use this file to map each facial capture parameter to the corresponding blend shape. We will need set the first eye blink left to this blend shape. But since the blend shape's names are in Japanese, it's challenging to input it in the mapping file. In the window menu, open the blend shape inspector we have installed. Select the facial mesh to see all blend shapes in the window. Select all the relevant blend shape names, right click, and copy them. Paste them into the corresponding mapping fields. Repeat the same steps for eye blink right, jaw open, and smile. Finally, drag the completed mapping file into the second array. Now Velen has facial capture set up. Run the project, and you can see the results.